Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to paint Goddess Saraswati using artist watercolors. And yes, you are super free to use any brand of watercolors of your own choice. So without wasting any time, let's get started. So I am using light blue now and I am using round brush number 5 but you can use any number round brush. So I am using number 5 round brush, camel brand. And don't forget to use water at regular intervals. Wa use water at regular intervals. You can follow me on Instagram, link is given in the description box and remember that I am super 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 lazy on Instagram. So actually I don't post regularly on Instagram so it's completely your choice to follow me or not. Now this is leaf green or light green and I am using the same brush throughout the process. Throughout the video I am using the same brush that is round brush number 5. For painting the borders of a sari, I am using the same color, leaf green or light green. I am using very less water now as I have to make it very darker, look very darker. So I am using very less amount of water now. Now this is sap green with very less amount of water. So now I am again using the same color, light blue for her sari so follow the same process as shown in the video use very less amount of water and whenever you think that the, that the sari is very much dark because of the color so then use water to make it lighter one more thing move the bristles of your brush very gently on the paper otherwise your paper will be damaged so move the bristles of your brush very very gently Paint a full attire with the same color light blue and use very less amount of water. Again I am using the same color, leaf green, the second color. So follow the same process as shown in the video. So now I am using medium yellow color with great amount of water for her skin, face, legs and hands and everything for her skin. Okay. Actually I don't have flesh tint or face color in this set. So if you have flesh tint color in your set then you can, then you are completely free to use that color. Flesh tint or face color. And I am using greater amount of water now.
So now I'm using color pencils. You can use any brand color pencils, but remember that this step is completely, completely optional. So now I'm using light blue color, but remember, Joby process hamlo is se kar rahe bhi from light blue color that the same thing will be done with watercolors too. So don't worry if you don't have color pencils. The same process will be shown with watercolors too. So this is completely optional step. So now I'm using light blue color, pencil color. Sharp your pencils if required, but this is completely optional, so you can skip this step. This is this of your cho choice. Man hai to do, and if you don't want, then skip this process. Now it's time for watercolors. I'm using light blue color with very 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 less amount of water, and I'm blending with water not watercolor with water okay so i'm blending with water and i'm using very very less amount of water for the strokes just give strokes in the same manner i am giving and blend with water so follow the same process as shown in the video for blending Remember, I'm not using any color. I'm using only and only water. For blending, I'm not using color. I'm using only and only water. And for the strokes, I'm using color. And no water. And for blending, only water. Make the similar strokes with light blue color using very less amount of water and then blend everything with water. So follow the same process. See I am blending only and only using water. I am not using color now. Only for the strokes I used color, light blue color. No, but now I am using only water. So see. So follow. Make strokes on her sari also with light blue color and blend with water. Now I'm again using leaf green color or light green color. For the strokes, I'm using only and only light green color, no water. And for blending, I will use only water, no color. So this is now time for blending. So I'm using only and only water. See, only water. No color is used for blending. And no water is used for the strokes. Remember. So follow. Now I am giving a layer of leaf green on the sap green part. You can also use sap green here. So now I am again giving layers to make it a little darker. So follow the same process. Okay, so as of now, I can see that the blending of right hand side is not perfect. So I'm again using water plus light blue for blending.
so use the same color water plus light green sorry light blue water plus light blue to paint her beautiful hairs i am using dark brown color and then i will do a layering with black color first i will use burnt sienna color and then i will do layer with layering with black color so now i am using burnt sienna that is dark brown or light brown so now it's turn for black color so paint and for the flute i am using burnt sienna plus dark brown color and in case you don't know that what is burnt sienna so let me tell you burnt sienna means brown color light brown is also known as burnt sienna or burnt sienna okay so for the flute i am using burnt sienna and dark brown mixture of those colors so now i am using black pen for the for making the beautiful patterns on her fall so follow the same process now this is red pen i'm using red pen on her legs now i'm using brown color pencil but this completely option you can skip this process this is red pen for making some extensions on the flute this again red pen for her bindi and for her jewelry i am outlining everything with red pen actually i am not uh, detailing i am not making much details on her jewelry i'll make a separate video for that and i'm using medium yellow plus lemon yellow color mixture of lemon yellow and medium yellow for painting the jewelry for the drum roll i'm using burnt sienna color so use burnt sienna for drum roll or burnt sienna that is brown light brown use light brown color for her drum roll now again black pen for some patterns on her attire now this black color pencil for the outline and darkening some of the areas on her attire so use black color pencil for darkening for our vermilion i'm using red watercolor so use red watercolor for her vermilion now this is also red color now i'm using white watercolor for some decorations so use white watercolor for some decorations I'm painting the swan with white watercolor. So paint the Hans of Hans Vahini with white watercolor. For eyes and feathers, I'm using black color pencil. You can also use black watercolor. So that's all. I hope you must have enjoyed the video. So that's all for today. Let's meet in another video.